The thyroid gland is a small butterfly-shaped organ in the neck. Its two lobes lie on either side of the windpipe and are connected at the front by the isthmus. The thyroid is a part of the endocrine system and secretes hormones that regulate metabolism, energy levels, body temperature, the heart rate, and influences mood. A thyroid nodule is a lump in the thyroid gland that forms from an abnormal growth of thyroid cells. Thyroid nodules are very common, especially in women, and the vast majority of these nodules are benign. A small percentage of thyroid nodules are malignant tumors, and the main types are papillary thyroid cancer, follicular thyroid cancer, medullary thyroid cancer, and anaplastic thyroid cancer. Radiofrequency ablation, or RFA, is a minimally invasive procedure that involves placing an RF electrode tip in a target nodule to shrink it. When high-frequency electrical currents are passed through the nodule, tissue ions vibrate and a local increase in tissue temperature occurs, causing tissue death. Before RFA, thyroid function tests in the form of blood tests are performed. These tests measure levels of different hormones and antibodies and are an important part of diagnosing and treating thyroid disorders. An ultrasound scan is also performed to evaluate the nodule characteristics. Finally, a biopsy is done to check for malignancy. The thyroid RFA setup consists of an RF generator, a pump, a grounding pad attached to each of the patient's thighs, and the RF electrode. After administering local anesthesia, the physician inserts the electrode through the skin to penetrate the nodule. The RF electrode tip is then slowly and continuously repositioned within the nodule to ablate it layer by layer. The nodule then shrinks over the next 12 months. Thyroid RFA is performed under ultrasound guidance, with the physician holding the ultrasound probe in one hand and maneuvering the electrode with the other hand. After the procedure, an ice pack will be placed on your neck to cool the treated area. You will typically be discharged after 20 to 30 minutes. Traditional thyroidectomies may leave a visible scar in the middle of the neck. Thyroid RFA, in contrast, is minimally invasive and leaves no scar after the small wound heals. In addition, lifelong hormone supplementation is not required after thyroid RFA. Many critical structures surround the thyroid gland, including the trachea, recurrent laryngeal nerves, common carotid arteries, and internal jugular veins. Nonetheless, thyroid RFA has a very low incidence of complications, with nodule rupture and voice change being the most common major complications. Pain and hematomas are the most common minor complications. Following the thyroid RFA procedure, you will be asked to visit the clinic after one month, three months, six months, 
and one year to follow up and monitor the outcome. Thyroid RFA is performed by head and neck surgeons, general surgeons, interventional radiologists, and endocrinologists. For more information about thyroid RFA treatment, consult a qualified physician near you.